folding smartphones. You've seen them, I've seen them, you might have seen them here on my YouTube channel. And this is one that I use on a regular basis. This is the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 2. Some would call this a traditional folding smartphone because this is the kind of concept that we have come to expect from a folding smartphone. But there is a new concept idea and this is what I'm gonna show you in this video. It's by Oppo and it's titled the Oppo X 2021 and I'm gonna give you a closer look. So straight off the bat, this isn't really considered a folding smartphone. It would be considered a rolling smartphone but the main concept is the same where you get a smartphone that then can extend out to something like a tablet. And that's exactly what the Oppo X 2021 does. You have an OLED display that starts off at 6.7 inches and then extends as large as 7.4 inches. Now, how it does this is very interesting, very unique. It does this based on some of the criticisms with the current setup that we have with folding smartphones. So if you've seen a folding smartphone, you'll know that majority of the way that they fold, whether it's outward, like the older Huawei Mate X, or inward, like the Samsung Galaxy Fold or the Flip, you'll notice that the screen is essentially crease or a line on there. This has been a big factor, a big, issue that some people would say that consumers certainly notice and I guess manufacturers are also looking at ways around that. Well, Oppo have come up with an idea which is actually quite ingenious. It doesn't fold in the traditional sense, it rolls out. The technology in here is basically made up of something called a roll motor powertrain. It balances the force at the same time between pushing and pulling on the flexible OLED screen. What that does is it allows you to retract and extend without those familiar you know, creases on the display. It gives you a smooth OLED display, whether it's retracted or extended. And the other way that it does this is it has support with a two-in-one plate. That means that when you're swiping, you're pressing on that display, there isn't going to be a gap that you know pushes through that display. So it gives you uh, rigidity and it also gives you strength in that display. There's also another thing that Oppo have done on this display, and that is something called Warp Track Laminate. It's developed by Oppo, and the idea here is that you strengthen the OLED display to make sure that it doesn't have those issues with the flexible display that you get with other folding smartphones. Now, this is a concept smartphone, so it's not necessarily available to purchase at the moment, but it does give us a really interesting idea, a different way of how you can put in practice the folding smartphone concept. What is also interesting is the software element, which has been crucial in any folding smartphone. If the software isn't right, then you're not gonna get this fluid, seamless experience on that display. And it seems like Oppo might have done that with the Color OS as well. This is a skin that goes on top of Android, but the ability to merge both the hardware and the software is gonna be really exciting to see. Let me know what you think about this concept of a folding smartphone. Is this something that you'd like to see in the future? If you've enjoyed this video, then hit here to check out another really cool video. I'll see you over there. Peace and blessings.